guys welcome back to my channel today i'm going to be showing you guys two ways to package your press on nail orders one is luxury and a little bit more pricey and one is affordable and beginner friendly we're going to be starting with the luxury more pricey version and we're going to be on uline.com for everything uline is perfect for small businesses because they sell everything in large quantities and it gets to you pretty quickly if I order on a Tuesday, I always get it the very next day. If I order on a Friday, I get it on Monday. Right now on the screen is the box I use for my press-on sets. All you have to do is search black base clear lid and it will take you right to where I was. This is perfect size for either one set or if you have multiple sets and it can fit up to like five or six. Now we're gonna look at the boxes, the boxes that you put everything in. And right now we're on the Uline homepage and we're gonna click on shipping boxes. We're gonna click on mellers. And then here are all the different mellers they have. I personally use white literature boxes. I feel like white is perfect and it stands out against all the brown boxes. And here are all the different size boxes they have it's a lot going on I know but the good thing is on the left hand side under model number you can hover your mouse over the number and it will show you a little picture of what that box looks like so in case you're more of a visual person you can look at like a 10 by 3 by 3 box and see what it would look like Now here is the box I personally use for my press on orders. I do consider myself to be a luxury brand so I do like to put them in nice boxes as opposed to bubble mellers. Now we're going to look at some crinkle paper. I feel like crinkle paper is a good filler in your box so that if you do have extra room in there everything's not like banging against each other during shipping. They have all these different types of colors, so it's really easy to find a color that goes with your branding. Tissue paper is another nice thing to have in your packaging so that it's not just the brown of the inside of the box, you know what I mean? And it can also be a color that goes with your branding. For example, if your brand colors are like pink and purple, you can do the crinkle paper pink and the tissue paper purple and I feel that that will set you apart against all the other press on brands because it's more of an experience when your customer is opening your order. So here I am putting everything together. This box is from Target. I didn't have any more of my Uline boxes so I couldn't go with that one but this box works if you do run out just like I did. <laughs> you just go to Target and pick one up. Here's the crinkle paper. I went with black because my brand colors are like nude tones and black. And here is what that nail box looks like you see like it looks good with one set but you can also fit a lot more sets in there for orders that had four five or even six now for materials that include your branding I do use canva for everything I make all my posts on here I make my instruction cards my thank you cards and my business cards on here for the template I use postcards um, I'll have the measurements in the description and if you look at the top right corner you can see you can print them out and that's how I get mine. So this is the instruction card and if you're not super creative and you don't know what to do they do have different type of design templates. You can see them right there in the left hand or left side of the screen. Canva is your bestie when it comes to your business. If you guys want a video with more in-depth things on canva let me know in the comments and i can do that for you now here i am just packing up that box and also adding the instruction cards and the thank you card And 
and now we're going to talk about the nail prep kit so when it comes to more luxury more pricey if you do price your nails pretty high you want to include nice things so the customers feel like they did get their money's worth with your nails so my luxury nail prep kit i do add a ring and a sticker and a cuticle oil and nail sticky tabs i feel like everyone has their own little thing other people add scrunchies or candy or their own brand stickers this is what i add and i feel like that will push people to take more nail fees because people do not be taking nail fees oh my gosh i make nails and i never see them again it makes me so sad so you guys can do things like this to make people want to take pictures of their nails i'm gonna show you guys a couple little things for my nail prep kit so this is my biggest recommendation you get 30 of these packs it comes with a buffer a file and a cuticle pusher for $40 you get 300 packs of them 300 it's worth your money instead of having to buy all three of them individually and then here is a 100 pack of KDS nail glue the best nail glue ever for me and it's only $34 that's the glue I include and then the sticky tabs this is what I include um, with my luxury press on nails not for my basic like uh, beginner one I feel like the, you already get the nail glue like you don't really need this it's not a must and then I package it all up with a branding sticker now this is my take on luxury or more expensive and more out there packaging you know what i mean not every press on brand needs to start at this you guys like i said before can put your own take on it you can include a scrunchie lip gloss candy would not recommend chocolate just make it your way but add more things to it so people when they're opening your order they're going through an experience you know what i mean all right for the more affordable or more so for beginners I would highly recommend Amazon to be your best friend and get very acquainted with Amazon. They have so much. This is just one quick small business packaging supply search. Look at everything that comes up. You got organza bags, packaging, bubble mailers, boxes, stickers. Um, a scale everything you need thank you cards which i'm going to show you again right now amazon is definitely going to be your bestie if you have a budget uline not so much that's why i say it's more luxury or just more when you're very into selling press-ons you know because it's a lot of money but amazon got you there's crinkle paper right there I love these bubble mailers and just to show you guys if you click on most bubble mailers they have different sizes I recommend the eight and a half by 12 for press-ons that box that I showed you for my more luxury ones will fit in that that size is just like all around perfect it's what I used when I used to use bubble mailers and if you don't want to use Canva you don't want to spend that money making thank you cards look at this sis just search thank you cards small businesses and amazon got you they got stickers they have so many thank you cards i'm sure you'll find one that goes with your branding and let's be real it's not like customers save these thank you cards if they do that's very kind of them <laughs> they're very kind for that But yeah, they have a thank you card for everything. Just in case you don't want to spend that money, Amazon got you. So here I am packaging the basic, the beginner level press on. Um, I am using my thank you cards because I have them. But again, you guys can get one off Amazon. Instructions. All press on nails should have instructions because you don't know if that's their first time. For the nail prep kit, it's very, very basic. It just comes with a buffer, a file, a cuticle pusher, um, the glue, an alcohol wipe, and my business card. But it does not come with all the extras. It doesn't come with sticky tabs or cuticle oil. That's all 
for the luxury. That's all for when they spend some shmoney. And this is how I would recommend packaging your nails if you don't want to invest into the big boxes yet, you know? Um, this is just a card. It's the postcard you guys saw me make on Canva. Same size. I'll put the measurements in the description. And I just have them on double-sided clear tape. Also from Amazon. It's in my Amazon list. And it's in this clear wrap. Also in my Amazon list. That's in my description. And this is my take on the beginner affordable packaging for press-ons. I hope you guys enjoyed the video and found some new things out. And I will see you guys next time.